Hello, I'd like to welcome all back to Besiege, but today we're doing the third level, because, um, we've got land to traverse. And as we all know so far, my objective has never been to be the smartest banana in the bunch. My plan is to be obtuse. To solve problems in manners esoteric, with means illogical. Why is the frame rate tanking so hard? I'm not going to have a lot of open right now. There we go. That might help a bit. No, it just, it just wants to complain. Now, how do you get over from point A to point B? It's a good question. So a lot of scientists who, on a daily basis, ask themselves the question, how does mankind do get from point A to point B? <laughs> it's not an easy question. It's not easily answered. That... We can do more than that. Oh, fine. Can I like... No, I can't twist it sideways. Well, alright, we'll do it some sensible fashion. Now, what matters is that this thing gets there, so what we really want to do... And this is just me speculating. Good, good. Okay. I want to do is I want to build a catamapult, but not the catamapult we've already built so far. No, no, no. I want this to be a different kind of catamapult. I want this to be a catapult that my father will be proud of. Just a hinge will do. Today I've got new plans. Stop telling me there's intersection. Okay, 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 okay. What I need to do is actually quite simple. Higher. I need more space, more room. This device will launch me to the Netherlands. You know, the lands in the Nether. You've probably never been into Minecraft. Allow me to explain. I was foolish when I made such an incredibly complicated device to shoot, you know, projectiles with. It can always be done in a simpler, more elegant fashion. Now, my personal experience, the tent. It's not even connected. Joy, oh joy. Better. No, maybe the front's better. It's hard to tell with these things sometimes. Excellent! It's got the mileage. Now all it needs is the angle. What it also needs is the stability not to constantly crush itself. As we all know, the Holy Cross is often reinforced with a set of supports. Commonly known as the Watsatuya supports, as proposed by Dr. Watsatuya. What a great man. Too bad he sucked. Okay, they could use some more bracing. Ooh, ooh. No! It just has too much speed. Doctor! How did that not count? Are we, are we off course? We're not off course. Yeah. 
Yeah. Bounding box. Off. To the ground. Oh, it's an inch too high to count. Well, we did it anyway. That's the point. My friends, my compatriots, my assistants in crime. The point is not to be smooth, sleek, or even fashionable. No, this won't work. This simply will not do. We need hinges. Steering hinges. This device is about to get really creepy. And I expect nothing but the finest of the lot of you. I will make a device that can walk. A machine that mimics human motion. A device that would transpire into history as madness. And I will say, yeah, it kind of is. The real question is, how the hell do we organize that? Now, the way that I remember human limbs working is that they generally go one direction. And I don't want that as... Okay, so this should theoretically work as long as I pull this onto a different one. I'll put that onto the numpads. Okay, that's steering. Left, right, left, right. Left, okay, okay, okay. The way I think that walking really works is that you have one side that goes that way, one side that goes that. As long as you keep them all consistent, it shouldn't be too much of a bother. And make sure that we have ourselves a. I like how the numpad tends to be the sort of default when people try to make things. These move forward. You want these to go. That way. That's how humans walk, right? Is they, they, they put their feet forward and then they put their other foot forward. Am I even going any Ah oh, man Building a walking device is difficult. Well, she does make walking like motions, but she seems to be able to do moonwalks. Hmm. So pistons is mostly because I've noticed that, you know, you can't really just walk like that. Spring. These are suspensions. I thought I was using hydraulics. Explains why everything was so wibbly whoop. Wibbly whoop is an important com uh, this do look alike. Put some of those underneath. The important part is that the right side pumps its pistons. Namely, the side that goes forward. We're going to call that side 4. We're going to call that side 5, 6, I guess. 6 is, six is good. 6 works. Okay, we can do this. We can do this. We can do this. There we go. 4. Come on. 4. four, four, four. Come on! You're just dancing circles! This isn't working. Also, please stop wibble wobbling like that. I really do not appreciate it. Maybe it's the feet. Maybe it's the feet. As Captain Johansson once said, maybe it is the feet. It's always the feet. It's never anything other than the feet. Look at this. No, no this isn't really... It's not really walking. I'm gonna cooperate, fine, just don't fucking show up then. Maybe I need to have them go at the same time, alright? Alright, we got that, got that, got that. I don't want to click something if I can't do anything with it. Steering hinge. Uh, this one is left. Left means it goes forward. Which means that the right one is the one that I want. I want this to be 
right, and I want this to be right, and I want this to be left, and I want this to be left. This isn't working! I can't walk! If I can't walk the walk or talk the talk, I'm supposed to be the cool kid in the school. Fuck it, we're scrapping it. We're gonna do something else. I want something smooth, my groove. How about a sled? I've always liked sleds. Been a big fan of sleds since I was two. That's not how sleds work. That's not how sleds work! Which means I need swivel joints and some wheels. And also an extended body. like that, but I want to steer in a peculiar fashion. I can't steer with a regular steering wheel. That'd be boring. Well, I can steer with it, but it's not particularly powerful. Needs more oomph. You know what old MacGuffin said when he was asked, Give it some more oomph, he said, just give me an inch. Let's use the steering. Don't use steering very often. Maybe if I put a giant wing on the tip. Now, this just can't go wrong. Oh, why doesn't it work? How much oomph do you need? Okay, maybe if we take it nice and slow. How about that? How about that? Sounds good, sounds good, sounds good, sounds good. Sounds good to me. It's almost like a seal. That won't work. But it needs some stability regardless. And put it like that. And we put some stability in. That's something to keep it together. It's something to make sure that this vehicle is 100% foolproof. <laughs> the fact you can just break it. Okay, fine. We'll start on the ground, you stupid wheels. Do 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 Okay, what if I put this on the little steering mechanism too? a better way to do this. Like, I would put the wheels on it, but I think I just got an alternate idea. I don't know if it counts, though, as a fair solution. But it's got to count for something. Let's just scrap it. Scrap it, scrap it, scrap it, scrap it. We need to scrap it. I need to put a steering at the bottom. Why does it call that flying speed? Just call it propeller speed, alright? That's all it really is. It still drives like a plane. I love it. And it can't go backwards, so technically it counts. Come on. Come on! I can do this! Damn it. No, 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 no! 
No! Yeah! <laughs> we did it! Ah, uh, the stupid mobile. Simple enough that I won't give a shit about it. Okay, now I want to do something else with this thing. I want to do something that's just amazing. I want to go over this. Not past it. I want to go straight forward, and I want to fly over this puppy. I want to go balls to the walls with this one. Okay, I can set the... Okay, now that's bringing us... As you can I set the piston? Can I set piston power? I cannot set piston power. Alright. Oh my god, I fucking hate the... the beep, 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 beep. Fuck off. Just, just... Those are springs, not pistons. Okay, so it is that we hit the button. It what is the fuck hits H? We hit the button and then we float over, which also means we're putting a small propeller at the front. With some adjustable ballast, because I've noticed something peculiar about this design. Okay, the center of mass is over there. I need it to be slightly more in the middle. Let's see, what is... Okay, maybe 1.25, does it? It's about where I want it. So if it gets some speed, it m might be able to make it, but... Doesn't count. I don't think that counts. I don't think that freaking counts. Let's crack it up. Let's put it on the max. You remember when they say, give me the max, give me the pain? They meant max pain. That's what they meant. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, I love it. It's such a dumb vehicle. Oh, I love it. Oh, oh, ooh. That's a lot better. It needs to have that nose, or else it won't die properly. It just, it's just such a cool vehicle. You could just, mm, I guess you could mount some, some, some things in the side. Okay, okay, I'm saving it. This one's called Bouncy Baby. Bouncy Baby, because it's a little simple vehicle to bounce. That makes me happy. That makes me so happy. Final thing. I want to make a fucking motorcycle. Okay, how do you make a motorcycle is the real question we're supposed to answer. Well, this is going to be the steering wheel. Of course, this is going to be a realistic motorcycle. I don't do fakes, people. I don't do fakes. I don't do fakes. That's just the way I work. That's just the way it is. Do -ba -doom, ba -ba -doom, ba -ba -doom. Things will never be the same. Wait a minute. I'm going to need you to swivel. Okay. So now, if I just change the buttons to K and L. Yeah! Or, if I was clever, I just put a steering. can't take this sometimes, you know? It still isn't... A what the fuck is your problem, wooden piece? Ugh. 
Okay. Why do we have a steering wheel? Need to make sure all the components add up. All right. Put this on the side. Put this on the side. Extend it downwards slightly. Put in some wheels. Ooh. What the fuck is it inter... Oh, the ground. Thought it was intersecting with a vehicle component. No, get, get that wheel off. I don't care about that wheel. No, I don't want... No! Stop annoying me! Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, that's starting to look frisky. It's not done yet, though. This isn't going to be any old motorcycle. We don't do any of the old motorcycle. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh. Can you feel the heat? It should have suspension, though. Like, it is a motorcycle. Come on. Give me that. Give me that one part of your life. Where you said to yourself, Why are you here? Just leave me alone. I didn't hurt nobody. That's that one moment in your life that you should be remembering right now. Oh my goodness, look at this thing go. It's not balanced at all. But that's not the point. The point is that it doesn't fall over. And <laughs> it does. See, the trick to a good motorcycle is that its balance is low to the ground. That's why the motor is is built underneath. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to put some adjustable ballasts at the bottom. This is our our engine, if you want to call it that. I don't. I wouldn't call it a freaking engine. It's not an engine. What the hell are you calling it an engine for, you doofus? Who are you, Obama? Ooh. We want to get in a clash with that guy. Okay, so this should be a little... It's still not stable, and it's also starting to show flimsiness because it's too much weight and too many paces. My eyes are watering up. It's been doing that all day because, boy, is it dry. It's also been very cold. Snowy today. Really cool. I love snow. Sort of love snow. Oh, oh, oh. We're going to have that engine mounted. Oh, oh, oh. Look at that mount. Could have rear-wheel drive, but that'd be stupid. Because who the hell uses a rear-wheel drive motor? I don't know. I don't, I don't even know if that's the, 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 the usual or not. I'm not a motorcycle expert. Um, okay, that won't work. I'm going to have to remove that piece. And then I want to put something on the front to make it look like a real motorcycle. I heard flamethrowers are all the craze lately. Nothing says biker. Like a good old-fashioned pair of pirate cannons. Do -do 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 -do. It falls over just instantly, and I think I know why. It's because the suspension isn't lined up. The suspension can't go imperfect. They need to line up perfectly, and if they don't, then guess what happens? The wheels go out of alignment. I can't believe I just made sense. Why did I make sense? Can someone please call my psychiatrist about that? That's not healthy. You see, that, that helps a bundle. It fixes so many problems. Well, that looks tight. Ooh, that looks tight. Ah, oh, ooh. It looks tight like leather pants from the Matrix. I love that joke. It's just a stupid joke, but... Gotta give him credit. There are a lot of people wearing very shiny gear. I may... The rear just... Just basically vomit? So I know the motorcycles are generally unbalanced, and it's the humans that's supposed to fix that problem, but this is just getting ludicrous. There's one way to fix this. Multiple ways. One is to add wings. Okay, I didn't mean, like, literal wings, but we can give it a shot! I mean, it is a motorcycle. should also, by the way, reverse this thing, because it's really bugging me. Oh, you can actually set the rotation speed. Listen, I understand that it's difficult being a motorized vehicle, but... It's not that steep of a fall, alright. 
Okay, we need to have our weight as low to the ground as we can get it. So let's sit. No. And whatever just happened, make it stop. I don't have to click the little exit menu because that's just stupid. Don't make me do that, please. See that? It helps so much. It's just kind of strange that I have to do it like that. No! Come on. And now it just collapsed. It just decided no. Why does it do that? Because of the cannons? Shut up, sheep. I just don't like you anymore right now. I can't make large turns, but she works. <laughs> Got this stupid... Oh, you want a piece of this? Want a piece of this? Oh, you can't handle this. You can't handle the truth. I think it probably would actually work better if I turned down the speed a bit and then go with it. What I could actually do, and I know this is insane, is attach several extenders on both sides to balance it out. Like they can shoot outwards like a balancing stick and sort of force the balance to go one way or another. But that's for a later idea. Like this this works. It works. It does something. Alright? I made a stupid motorcycle for a stupid challenge. And to prove that it works, I'm gonna drive it at two times speed and it's gonna work just fine. Maybe, you know which just dawned to me what might actually help a bunch. And I know this this is like this is fucking mad science and all that kind of stuff. Like I know there's scientists out there who'll say like no you can't do that. Training wheels. Oh my goodness. This is why training wheels were really invented. It's because one biker said, you know what I'm sick and tired of the fact that I have to abide by your she it technically isn't a bike, but I already did the bike idea and it worked, alright? Like we did the bike. Now we have a stupid bike that has training wheels. Because I suck. Oh, who am I kidding? It's not a bike yet. We need to pimp this ride. It's not a bike until the fat lady says so. The fat lady is strangely picky about that kind of stuff. Ooh. Ooh, you dirty bo- Oh, you're taking away those braces, aren't you? Ooh. Ooh, you don't care about your dental hygiene, do you? Ooh. I never see this being used, so this is the place to do it. Yeah! <laughs> ooh, 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 I know, I know, I know. I know that kind of ruins the suspension concept. Actually, the, the the way the training wheels are set up, I could just remove these, I think. It's a lot more of a dodgy ride, but I don't care. We're done. The bike. The bike! See you guys next time. Hope you enjoyed the video. Didn't complete it officially, but fine. I'll open up the baby. The baby actually does perfectly fine. It is the smallest vehicle I've ever made. Which can do this. Whee! Wait, I need to turn this off first. I also need to turn down the speed to a reasonable amount. Doing this, by the way. 
I like you could flip it. It reminds you of those old remote controlled cars you could get where it could be like. <laughs> Next time, we've got to face the perimeter wall. We've got an easy blow up, but the actual target is that. Where the hell is my thing? I have a catapult. Should probably rework that one that I built before, that really big one, into something. Because that actually worked. It was a little bit too powerful, but it really worked. Yeah! See you guys next time!